Welcome to Reading English Aloud. I am going to recommend how to buy bread in a supermarket. This is a lesson about uh, the best bread to buy in a supermarket. I think bakeries in Canada are spectacular. If you don't have a bakery in your town or village, then go to your local supermarket and look for the in-store bakery section. The in-store bakery will be all the breads that are baked in the supermarket, usually very early in the morning. So they are available when you come in, when the supermarket opens. This is a very fresh, it's called Canadian Harvest Bread, and it is baked daily in my local supermarket. This is different from the big industrial bakery breads. You can tell the difference by looking for, it's usually a very plain plastic wrapper. The plastic bag it has no design or decoration on it. And the label is very, very simple. Okay, so this is the best and healthiest bread to get at a bakery. So the bread that I get all of the time is called Fresh Baked Canadian Harvest bread and if you look at the picture it has the date on it the date that it was made it was may 12th and it's best before may 16th so you can always find bread on the day that you go to the supermarket always look at the labels and see which day that bread was baked because you can always always find bread that was baked on the day that you are shopping in an in-store bakery and this bread i think is very cheap it's only two dollars and 99 cents and it's a very healthy bread so suitable for sandwiches or just or making toast um, very good we like to make uh, we like to have sandwiches for lunch so we usually get this bread we walk to the supermarket and we buy a loaf of bread like this, maybe every two or three days. Let's look at some different popular types of sandwiches you would find, you can easily find in Canada. So ham sandwich or ham and cheese sandwich, grilled cheese sandwich, uh, that's hot, it's cooked, it's fried in a pan, and the cheese is melty and delicious. You can use all sorts of different types of different types of cheese for that for grilled cheese sandwich to get very fancy. Tuna salad sandwich. When you see salad in the name, it usually it means it's mixed with something is mixed with mayonnaise, and this is tuna from a can mixed with mayonnaise. It's a cold sandwich. Egg salad sandwich. Same thing. Egg salad. It would be be hard boiled eggs mixed with mayonnaise. Um, spicy chicken wrap. That would be uh, like a spicy, crunchy chicken. And the bread would be a type of flatbread and you just roll everything. You roll, roll the chicken up in the flatbread. BLT, bacon, lettuce, tomato. Uh, clubhouse, this is bacon, lettuce, tomato, and turkey. This is a very traditional clubhouse. You may see it with ham or cheese or other types of meats, but this is the classic clubhouse sandwich. And then we have another type of sandwich. It's called the hot sandwich. It's hot turkey sandwich or a hot chicken sandwich. That would be sometimes just one slice of bread with a hot chicken on top of it and then gravy on top of that. Or you would have uh, turkey on top of it, usually and gravy on top of that. Uh, hot turkey, we usually have hot turkey sandwiches after Thanksgiving. We use leftover turkey to make a hot turkey sandwich. You can also, sometimes you have two slices of bread with the gravy on top of that. It's a really delicious sandwich. Um, that's it. Thank you for reading English aloud with me and please subscribe to my YouTube channel.